Hello and welcome back to Layers of Fear. We are continuing on our journey to build this character. Um, we've got Carcer. A house is built of walls and beams. A home is built of fears and dreams. I think we saw that already. Oh, yes. I think we've seen a lot of this already. Yeah, okay. Once again, my door is very aggressive. Things have been cleaned up a little bit. Ooh, yeah, there it is. And an arm. Whoa. There was life before the ship. A reason for their escape. They didn't dare look back. But their past fueled them for years. They harnessed it without remembering. They transformed fear, anger, and despair into art. The art was called outstanding, haunting, unforgettable. But they did forget. They did their best to forget. And when they weren't looking, their past entangled them, bound them, their roots suffocated them, pulled them under, away from the air and the light. They had to cut them away. Only then could they be truly free. Okay, there's our arm. Okay, we're not... Oh. Uh... Okay, guess we're going this way. I hear whispers. What are you doing? Here, listen. But how does it do that? A sea couldn't fit in there. It's the spirit of the sea. It captured its strength, its calm, its freedom. So it can live on forever. I can stand up now. I don't have my flashlight anymore, though. I feel little. Okay, there's that drawing again. Lots of movies, and it wants me to go this way. Okay. Huh. Down we go. Oh. This is very similar to the painter's house. A 
I'll be sending over a new reel tomorrow. Pirate film. Heard the Yanks love it. Give this one a good spin. More screenings means more arses in the seats, and more reason for me to keep paying you. Key to the kitchen. Well, let me... I kind of want to... Yeah, so they really wants me to go there, so I want to go down here first. Oh. Okay. Oh. Yep. Oh, you started up again? That's fine. Whoa. Come, faithful servant. For tonight we brew a ghoulish concoction. The world's strangest stew. Okay. Barley, the cannoneer. He eats a whole lot. He eats a lot, a whole lot. So he is round, like a cannonball himself. This one time, he almost shot himself out of a cannon. Let me close that. We'll come back to that. And now we go in here, I guess. Whoa. That's pretty. Brain, huh? Seasoned by sadness. Whoa. Burnt from within. Ravaged by madness. Rotten with sin. Yikes. Heard a drawer somewhere. Let's go in the green door. I still don't have a flashlight. Hi. I have this. Torn up by conflict. Ravaged by war, flawed on the surface, warped to its core. Thank you. Okay. This door. Locked. Okay, this door. Not locked. Ooh. Not reassuring, though. Axe? Oof. Gonna leave, I think. Let's throw this stuff in the pot. Oh. Oh. Still can't go in there, so I guess we missed something in here. Ah. Hollowed by longing, hardened by loss, once slick and polished, has lost all its gloss. Look at it bubble, 
Look at it shake. The beast. It's awake. Okay. That's cool. Look, Jimmy. Father's screening the Black Wanderer. Ooh. He's almost over. Time to go. Okay. Ooh, bedroom key. Am I supposed to go back or go forward? I think I'm gonna just keep going. Oh. James something. In recognition of your distinguished service in documenting the courageous struggle of His Majesty's troop on, troops on the Western Front, as well as injuries sustained on the field of battle, the War Office has decided to award you with the Silver War Badge. May you wear it with pride, knowing that you have fulfilled your duty to King and Country. The decoration ceremony will take place on the 5th of January. Sincerely, I don't know. On behalf of the Chief of the Imperial General Staff. Delilah, the top man, top woman. She likes boys a lot, and girls too. She's very friendly, maybe a bit too much. Sure, okay. Oh, nice. Guess we're coming up to see you. Yikes. Oh. Oh. Okay. There's a lot of places I could put it. Alright, I guess just two. That's not a lot, huh? Little scum. You were always bad luck. A blight upon this family. I give everything. And what do I get in return? Oh. A little gratitude. A little heart? Is that too much to ask? I told you to hide it. I told you to keep it safe. How could you let him take it? It's all we have left of her. 
You have to find it. You have to take it back. Okay. Find it. Okay. Bring it back. Give me a second. Back on you. Let us scum. You were always bad luck. A blight upon this family. A blackened heart, uprooted by tragedy, skewered by pain. That's all you've ever given me. That's all you were ever good for. What is that? You to hide it. I have it. I told you to keep it. I safe. have it. Keep her close to your heart. Don't let her be forgotten. Oh, I see she her. She gave everything for you. Prove that it was worth it. That you weren't a mistake. That seems like a rough burden to put on a child. Oh, rat block. Oh. Oh. Okay. Weak, useless, no good to anyone. Mirror? It's life. I was never there. It would have been better if I was never there. Oh. Can't go through. I can go through. Oh, back here again. Let's go. Father will be leaving the projection room soon. Basement. Ow. Can't go there. So last time they said, don't step into the light. Show yourself, ye one-eyed freak! I'll make ye wish ye had a spare. My hero. My beloved husband, as to my prospects, the doctor remains cautiously optimistic. His concern is that the difficulties I had giving birth to Lily might lead to certain complications. Still, he believes that I am more than able to bring another child into the world, and as with you by my side, I believe so as well. I admit the pains have been getting stronger as of late, but I dare not complain. Compared to what you've been through, my suffering is barely worth mentioning. Forever yours. That's not how pain works.
suffering, pain, it's not a quantifiable, comparable thing. It's worth mentioning if it's there at all. It doesn't matter if it's more or less perceived more or less than anything else. When the world becomes too cruel, we look for a place to hide. The dark can be many things. That looks like a place to hide. Let me finish looking around first. Be refuge. Okay, well I have that now. Oh, I can get it. All the heads in there now. Whatever you make it. Oh. Okay. Oh. Uh. The dark can be a silent place. Silence can be empty. Or it can speak volumes. It is whatever you make it. Oof. Dark can be a lonely place. Uh. Solitude can be a sentence. Oh. Into the box. Oh, it can be a companion. It is whatever you make it. Going back again. Oh, my gosh. Sometimes it's better to hide, to let the dark in. Father's coming. Quick, get it. No, please. I said, get in. Okay. land is a wonder to be sure but how will i ever get home home now why'd you want to go to such an awful place Okay. Ooh. That's cool. Hush, it's already started. Okay. 
child room. Come on, he'll get mad if we're not back before him. Okay. Oh, hello. <laughs> what is that thing? I thought I knew, but now I'm not sure. Oh, Jimmy, it has to take shape in your head first. Otherwise, it'll just stay formless. There's that word thrown around again. It's also the same idea the painter had about painting. Nope. Okay. My beloved husband. It's with trembling hands that I write this letter. Words cannot express how overjoyed I am to finally hear from you. When I heard of what happened, my heart sank. It was as if a terrible shadow had eclipsed my life. But now that I know that you're still with us, I feel that shadow has lifted. As much as it pains me to hear of your injuries, I pray that you find solace in the fact that you'll be here to witness the birth of our second child. Forever yours. Okay. Hi. Oh, she's talking to the writer, isn't she? She's not talking to me. Yikes. What is that? This is why you come in. Okay. Whoa. Oh my god. Go on, pick it up. Pick what up? Oh, recording. Uh oh. It seems the tables have turned, Quartermaster. Curse what? you and your mutinous puppets. I will not make this easy for you. If I am to meet my doom today, it will be by your hand, by your action. I supposed to? What what am I doing? Play your part, villain. I'm waiting. Okay. Don't do it. That's right. Don't hesitate. You know I wouldn't. The director doesn't want me to. Yes. Okay. Too late to build your character, boy. You wanted to be like me? Shoot! I'm following the director's instructions this time. What are we to you? Mere playthings? We. Play your part. What? You thought you could be me? You will always be just a scared little boy. What? Oh. Lily, are you all right? Lily, Lily! <gasps> Lily, I thought you were gone. That's because I was. Well, she is. What? Who I was a moment ago is no more. Now, I can become someone else.
Oh. Okay. No one understands them. No one will understand you. Hmm. Watch. This is the best part. The whirlpool? Come. We can't stay any longer. Office. Okay. Oh. I know. Henceforth. I shall be Captain Baines, the Black Wanderer. But Captain Baines isn't a girl. Steady your tongue, Quartermaster. I can be whoever I choose to be. If your little mind says otherwise, then to the depths with it. <laughs> okay. Close it, please. Piano. Oh. Okay. I have this now. Oh. Midas, the helmsman. He loves gold above all else. He can smell it half a world away. So he always steers the ship towards treasure. Okay. Another bit. It's like a spaceship. Oh. Okay, I maybe shouldn't have pressed that. Oh, I'm building my spaceship. Oh, that's the plug for the... Okay. There's the top of my spaceship. Nice. Okay. No, oh, wait, it doesn't go there. It goes here. My brother, he was always there, following in my footsteps, silent, smiling sadly. Like a warm shadow. Always there, but never really present. Sometimes, when darkness fell across town, he'd sneak out of the house. He'd look up into the night sky, watching the stars, but never really seeing them. What he really saw was a thousand souls on fire. Oh. His eyes would light up. The stars were already there. At that no. moment, I knew he had it in him. To make a thousand hearts bleed. A thousand heads turn. A thousand eyes weep. My brother. Oops. Silent dream. 
dreaming that a day would come when we could leave it all behind. The journey of a lifetime. Oof. A light on the horizon. A flame to call his own. Yes, he had it in him. To make a thousand souls burn. Make them feel alive. Make them live forever. A thousand lives. But never mind. Never mind. There we were. Dreaming ourselves away into the night sky. When we could almost reach out and take it. Oops, shit. When we could almost reach out and take it. A cruel shade eclipsed the sun. Our dream was gone. Whoa. Something else took its place. Uh oh. Something vicious. Something. I'm trying to wrap my head around that. Um. The discussion of flames continues. Oh, okay. Hello, everybody. Um, it feels like she's saying he has the means to become a great actor, but inspire people but not her? That's where it loses me a bit. Oh no! What will the Black Wanderer do now? Go to the bathroom. That's what he's gonna Don't do now. Worry. One day we'll get to see how it ends. Did I? Oh. I probably missed something the first. No. No, no, no. Something bad happened. What if I can't find you? Shh. Listen to my voice. Hold it deep inside, and I will always be there for you. Forever. Forever. Oh. Shoot. To the bathroom. Oh, wait. First this. Births to Mr. and Mrs. Abram, a daughter at St. Bartholomew's Hospital, Saturday, February 3rd at 11.30 p.m. Mr. and Mrs. Hopkins, son, St. Thomas, February 4th, 4.30 Mr. and Mrs. Burns, a son, St. Bartholomew's, February 4th, 2 a.m. Wilkes, a daughter at the Royal Hospital, 5th at 6. Deaths, Burns. Anderson, entered into rest Saturday, February 3rd, 6 p.m., beloved son, funeral Tuesday. Burns, entered into rest Sunday, February 4th at 2 a.m. Sunday, February 4th at 2 a.m., beloved wife, mother of two. Ooh. Green. Miller. So, Burns. Okay. Lemon.
the lemon that zapped me, I guess. Okay. Oh, good. Oh. Okay. If you want to make it to the end, just remember, the monster can be scary, but it's sad too, because at the end of the day, it's just as lost as we are. Oh. Okay. Look through. Oh, now I'm in here. What am I doing? Oh. Okay, so that makes the storms. I don't want that. And then this... I already did whatever that was. Now I look back out. Oh, there's a storm there too. So I want to stop it. And do that. Maybe I'm not understanding. Yeah, get that out of here. So that's the rain. Which is good for growing a plant. Okay. There. Now I can look through this keyhole. Looks like a crab claw. So, wind's not going. Oh. Also good for a plant. But apparently not good enough. Oh, it's not a plant. <laughs> okay. Oh dear. Oh. Okay. Dear sir, in regards to the recent inspection carried out on your premises and on behalf of the county council, I hereby oblige you to introduce necessary fire safety and prevention measures, i.e. ensure the theater equipment is compliant with the schedule of fire resisting materials, ensure the theater infrastructure facilitates escape in the event of fire. You have 30 days to comply. Regards. His Majesty's Inspector of Constabulary and Fire Services. Just get this. 30 days? Just got this. 30 days, daft buggers. Stall them. Why would you stall them? What? 
who? She's the one, Mr. Hardy. She's the one that would take us there. Okay. Oh, good. Lucia, the first mate. She won't have no one disrespect the crew or the captain because she is very proud. So proud. No, please. Oh. Okay. Stay out of it, Lily! Why... why can't you just... just leave us alone? Oh my gosh. You filled the boy's head with nonsense. As if it wasn't useless enough. No, that tree had a secret. Darn. You're... you're the one who's useless, you cruel, one-eyed freak! What did you call Get me? Get away from him! You... you monster! Hi! Whoa! Oh. Well, that's good. Oh my goodness. Oh, ow. Light is my friend. Okay. to come back this way? Uh, ok. 
Okay. Oh, look at all the little pirate boats. Cannon. Some people. Uh. Let me. Okay. Okay. Just gonna keep running, I think. fish. Haha! -ha. Safety. So I go this way. Okay. This is fun. It's really pretty environment too. This is so pretty! Whoa! Okay, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Ah. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Whew! Hello. Father, it's today. I know. I'm going to see her. Take care of the house while I'm gone. Did you get anything for James? It's his day too. Yes. I I had to buy something for your mother. That's uh -huh. all I could afford. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh. Treehouse. You're just like him. Oh, nice. Please help me. It hurts. It hurts. I can't take it anymore. Make it. Come on, there's nothing left for us here. It hurts. It hurts. Uh, it hurts. I don't know what's happening. It is it over? No, Mr. Hardy. It's only just beginning. They're not saying anything. My spirits, as in a dream, are all bound up. My father's loss, the weakness which I feel. No more keys. Breathe. Oh. Oh. 
A disturbing occurrence happened during a public reading, and the author acted strange from the start, but what happened after a particular reader's question? The masterpiece author banished from public library. That's me, isn't it? Did this place torment you too? Pests. Why? Delusional? Metaphor? What if they were there? So... Okay, I'm not going to play those right now because I am still right in the middle of the actor story. I came back. After a decade of glory and shame, I came back. I don't know how the fuck they knew I did, but I don't care. I will get my son back, or I will hurt them. I can write without her. I know I can. And this is... This must be the thing that hurts her, destroys her. Yeah, why else would she be so intent on trying to get you to keep her help? Okay. Oh, God. Light symbolism. Electric, fire, warmth, destruction, safety. Key for painting. <sighs> Did it help him? Well... The light was always something he wanted. And the Rat Queen talks about darkness. I don't know what's happening. So sharp. After all this time. I didn't open the door up there. I feel like I'm doing this not the way that's intended. Pain is hers. Influence on psyche and art. Call and ask. No. No. This is one thing I won't do. Looked like the wife's silhouette. This used to be the kitchen. Don't think I didn't notice that. Ah, good. Did you think your art would make you immortal? It's unwatchable now. Okay, I'll answer, I'll answer. What's going on? Hi, Mama. What? How? It's been a while, so... Just wanted to check on you. I... I'm glad you're writing again. You are? Of course. I know you. It's always been the most important thing in your life. That's... I should probably leave you to it. It's been great hearing from you. Wait, don't... Bye. Don't go!
Was that actually him? Oh! Oh dear. Oh, Jesus Christ. Who, the artist? Well, he was an abusive piece of shit, so... You think yourself an artist? Fun breaking his bones and kicking him, watching him spit blood. They were proud of themselves. Whoa. You're mine. Nuh uh. You have nothing to say. Green, perfect. Oh, uh, okay. No voice, no characters, no talent. your words are empty. Underneath there is only your ego. I made you. You didn't though. She was writing way before she went to the lighthouse. talking about Oh have to I 
I will finish it. Don't say that. You'll finish it on your own. But th that specific phrase... I don't think is what we desire. Last exhibit. Recreation of exhibit opening with piano. At home. Aruborus. After all these years, they still listen to you. Heavy burden goes through the hypnotic maze. Yeah. Boy, was it. The beginning. They used their daughter to fulfill their needs and ambitions. No wonder she grew up to be a woman she was. They were very specific about having her do well with art, do well with music. I don't really know much about... They probably added more in this, and I just, I'm... I haven't, like, watched it, played it yet. I feel like I've been very, a lot more quiet, um, this episode, um, I think it's because it's a lot new, more new information to take in. Um, this felt very... I mean, they're all lore-heavy, but this chapter felt especially lore-heavy. Especially with what's going on right now, with the writer, even. Masterpiece to be adapted for cinema. Oh, good. A best selling biography of the masterpiece is to be filmed in Hollywood, our sources say. The biography of struck the hearts of millions, and now one of the most mysterious directors <gasps> in Hollywood plans to. Masterpiece. I should have read those before I clicked on my son's picture. One of the siblings. Up to interpretation, which one? Of course, I can pull it off. Director. Pro James.
I have to finish it. Let's look around at, oh hello, all of our new stuff and then that's a wrap for this episode. Four. Tell me James, do you like sitting here in the park? Oh my goodness. Okay. Wow. What's going on? I've been told that you didn't show up on the set. It's like you vanished into thin air. The director seemed pleased, though. For whatever reason. Don't know what to make of it. Hope you're alright. Your friend and agent. Oh. Well, the director's still happy with the shit I'm doing, so character, go all the way. Let your heart bleed. Great. I'm oh, sorry, it's not technically character, it's character. Character. Oh, I missed one. Well, that makes sense. I was pretty scattered. So that's... There are the siblings. And there's the dad. Ooh, you're coming further out of the wall. Don't know if I like that very much. Haha! Oops, shoot. Target that. Give it to me. Anything else out here? that I see. Did I just get the flag? Missed another poster as well. Treehouse. Build the character. Turning point. Step back. Breathe. Remember. Moments that change one's life. Scars that define them. All right. Well, we covered a lot of stuff. So I had a really good time. I'm still piecing it all out in my brain, and will continue to do so as I replay and stuff, make sure I get every ending, of course. But there is still, it looks like, 
one final chapter left in the actor's life to explore. So we will be doing that next time. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.